Hi everyone, in this video I want to talk about a book that I bought a long time ago. It's a book written by Serge Lang and it's called Calculus of Several Variables. I'm pretty sure I got this book uh, around the same time that the author passed away. It might have even been the same day. I'm not positive, but I remember getting the book in the mail, going on the internet, and googling Serge Lang and finding out that he had recently died. So, pretty sure he was alive when I ordered the book. And when I got the book in the mail, he had passed away. And I always thought that was really creepy. I mean, it's just coincidental. Uh, but I held on to the book, and I did read it. And it does give you a different perspective on calculus. So if you're taking Calculus 3, uh, this book will give you a different perspective. Let's take a look inside it. So this is the table of contents. He starts off with vectors. Then he goes on to differentiation of vectors. Then he talks about functions of several variables, then the chain rule, and the all-important gradient. Uh, Lang does a good job explaining all of these sections. I have read various sections, and it's written very differently than your newer calculus books. Um, is it better? Is it worse? I'm not sure. It's just different. Let's keep going. He jumps into potential functions, and then goes on to what he calls curve integrals, double integrals, Green's theorem, then triple integrals, surface integrals, maximum and minimums, some higher derivatives, matrices, then he talks about linear mappings, determinants. So this is stuff that a lot of the modern calculus books uh, don't discuss. Applications to functions of several variables the change of variables formula. He actually does briefly talk about Fourier series and series in the appendices. So the readability of this book is excellent. Uh, I'm a huge fan of the way Serge Lang writes. I think it's clear and to the point. Um, some people don't like the way he writes. They think it's too terse. I think uh, clarity is absolutely the most important thing in mathematics. And if someone is clear, then I can learn from them. And I think Serge Lang's writing uh, is always very, very clear. The exercises in the book are one of its strong points. So not only does the book read really well, um, Lang has appropriate exercises for the readability. In other words, you could read the book and you could do most of the problems, uh, if not all, on your own. Also, one of the big pluses of this book is that Lang does include answers to most of the exercises. So you can actually check your work, which is extremely valuable when you're first learning a new topic. And again, uh, in this case here, you'll notice a lot of the exercises do match up with what you'll see in your typical Calculus 3 course, right? Directional derivatives, mostly computational. Here's a question on a temperature distribution. I know that's a problem that I sometimes assign in my, cl my class as well. Uh, etc. So this is really standard stuff. Now not all of it is like that, right? Lang does have uh, some more specialized topics that you won't find in modern calculus books. And also the way it's written is a little bit differently, which is always good. This is the section on Lagrange multipliers and this is where Lang explains why the formula for Lagrange multipliers actually holds, right? Lang does a really good job uh, explaining that. Again, uh, Lang is a great author, and this is a fantastic book. So the book, again, is Calculus of Several Variables, and this is the second edition, and it's written by Serge Lang. That's it.